He climbed the peaks of Mount Kenya, including Nelian and the Twin Peaks in 1929. He was among the first climbers to reach the summit of Kumate, the highest peak at the time, in 1931. He played a significant role in various Mount Everest expeditions, including leading the pioneering 1951 expedition. His name is Eric Shipton. In 1928, Eric Shipton ventured into the Himalayan region and arrived in Kenya as a coffee grower the following year. It was there that he had his initial taste of mountaineering, as he successfully ascended Nelian, a peak of Mount Kenya, in 1929. Kenya's European community would prove to be a pivotal place in his life, as it was here that he crossed paths with his future climbing partners, Bill Tillman and Percy Wynne Harris. Teaming up with Wynne Harris, Shipton tackled the twin summits of Mount Kenya. In 1931, he accomplished another remarkable feat by being among the first climbers to reach the summit of Kumate, which stood at an impressive 7,756 meters, making it the highest peak climbed at that time. Shipton's involvement with Mount Everest expeditions soon followed. He took part in Hugh Rutledge's 1933 expedition and also joined the 1936 follow-up. In 1935, Shipton led his first expedition to Mount Everest, which also marked the debut of Tenzing Norgay, who would later become a legendary mountaineer. Furthermore, Shipton played a vital role in the groundbreaking 1951 Mount Everest expedition, during which he charted the iconic route over the Kumbu Glacier that would be followed by future climbers. Additionally, Shipton and Tillman made a significant discovery in 1934 as they found the access route to the Nanda Devi Sanctuary through the Rishi Ganga Gorge. Their expedition in the Kemal Garwal Mountains, operating on a shoestring budget, bravely endured the challenging conditions from pre-monsoon to post-monsoon, setting a record for single expedition achievement that remains unmatched. The extraordinary expeditions and discoveries made by Eric Shipton and his companions have left an indelible mark on the field of mountaineering, inspiring adventurers worldwide. From the peaks of Mount Kenya to the majestic Himalayas, their feats of courage and determination have expanded human knowledge and shown us the beauty and grandeur of our planet's most breathtaking landscapes. After serving as Consul General in Kashgar in 1946, Eric Shipton embarked on a series of explorations and mountaineering endeavors. Together with Bill Tillman, he attempted to climb Musta Atta in 1946, reaching the summit dome. During this time, he also discovered and named Shipton's Arch. In 1951, while exploring the Rolling Heimel, Shipton became the first Westerner to explore the region. He named Island Peak during his exploration of the Barn Gorge. In the same year, he participated in the Everest expedition, capturing photographs of footprints that may have belonged to the Yeti. Believing in small expeditions rather than large-scale efforts, Shipton was replaced as the leader of the 1953 Everest expedition. Following this, he worked as the warden of the Outward Bound Mountain School at Eskdale, until his marriage ended in failure. He then took on various jobs, including farm work, and led a group of students from the Imperial College of Science on an expedition to the Karakoram in 1957. If you want to discover more adventurers on YouTube, make sure to hit that subscribe button for my channel, and don't forget to leave a comment in the section below, telling us which adventurers you'd like us to feature next.